thanks so much for clicking on this video i am so happy you are here we're gonna get straight into it and i'm going to be uh starting my wrapping journey today and I, I, we got a lot of love and gifts to share this year so i'm just going to put on some nice christmas music and get to work <laughs> have a beautiful mess here and I ran out of tape and boxes so we're gonna have to uh, take care of this later all right it is 12 30 and it is time to break my fast I do intermittent fasting I stop eating at 7 p.m. and I start eating around it's always different every day it's like either noon or like between noon and 2 I know it's it's kind of a stretch but I need a little pick-me-up, but I wanted to show my new cup. Look how cute. She's so cute. I bought this from Rose Bear Creations. She's a small business. I found her on Amazon or <laughs> on Instagram, and it's just the cutest thing. It's like a, a little Louis Vuitton monogrammed, and then this little bow topper straw topper adorable we love bows here so i'm gonna make a a drink i don't know what drink i'm gonna make yet i'm so sure but we're gonna do that and i'm gonna make some eggs and some fruit and finally eat because i'm starving we got ezekiel toast and two eggs and my matcha latte okay can anybody relate to this I feel like I've been checking my mailbox and the doorstep like 10 times a day because I'm waiting for all these packages to arrive that are Christmas presents. And I'm like, wow, <laughs> Christmas is a week away. Hopefully my packages come. <laughs> So it's about 1 p.m. now and yes 107 and I'm gonna do some more work on my laptop my charger is so weird I have a MacBook it's probably like three years old now and the charger will only work if I'm on the floor like if the charger is on the floor 
and I'm on the floor with my laptop, it only charges that way. Like it won't, um, it won't like go through my desk and up and like attach and charge it anymore, which is so inconvenient. So let me know if anybody else has that experience. I swear my like past two chargers I've had have done that. So I constantly have to get new ones, but Anyway, I'm gonna sit down in front of my lovely Christmas tree and get some work done for next for the next couple of, of hours. So I have some groundbreaking news. I went to Target yesterday and bought a couple cute things that I wanna share. First of all, look at this color palette that I have been trying to build up for the past couple months. And most of these are from Target. So yesterday, I got this little grandma sweater and I absolutely love it. Like, that is adorable, excuse me. I have nothing like this. I love this um, this brand, Wild Fable. They have the best prices. All these sweaters are like $20 or cheaper. And then the other one I got was this. Like, excuse me, so cute. I love the puff sleeve. It is so soft. Oh, I love it. I also got these adorable earrings. I haven't worn dangly earrings since I was in high school and that was literally a decade ago. So I'm very excited that all of these are like back in style now. Not that I'm super trendy, but I'm like really happy that these are like a thing again. And also, excuse my nails, we're actually gonna go and do my nails right now because this is just atrocious and unacceptable. So this is my gel nail kit. I'm pretty sure I've shown this before, but I bought this I think like three years ago and it still works perfectly. I think it was 30 bucks. It gives you the whole kit to get started and one nail polish. And then on Amazon, they have all these really inexpensive gel nail polishes. Uh, these are the only colors I have right now. I definitely need to build up my collection. But this is so easy. It takes probably like 10, 15 minutes and my nails last for like two weeks. It's, it's such a great deal. just recently got this new Too Faced Natural palette and I'm loving it. I just wanted to share it with y'all. Um, they were having a sale. Too Faced was having like a sale every single day. And I think I got this for like 50% off. But it has everything you need and I thought this was going to be perfect for when I travel to Florida. Because I'm living in Florida for the month of January. And this just has everything I need so I don't need to bring like a separate bronzer or blush. And I love it. This highlighter is really popping. So is the blush. So I'm going to use Pink Wink. And I I love blush. Like, I, I go overboard with blush. And I'm aware, and we've talked about this before, but I just love it so much. just feel like it brings so much more life to my face. Because my face is pretty pale because my SP, or... The CC cream I use, which is It Cosmetics, has 50 SPF. But anyway, I love this palette. I'm going to blend it out, clearly. But it's so good. You need it in your life. But anyway, I wanted to talk about something that's... Wondering if anybody else experiences this, but I think I have to get rid of TikTok. I don't really make TikToks. I think I have like five on there. Um... But I like, I'm not addicted to TikTok. It's more of like, if I'm really bored and I have nothing else to do, I may maybe get on it once a day for like five minutes, like maybe. But every time I've been getting on lately is, uh, it's not good. It's, I don't know what happened, but I'm on the toxic side of, of uh, TikTok in my opinion, because every TikTok that keeps popping up is about weight loss. And I'm like, how did this get on here? Because I don't think I liked or did anything for this to like continue on my For You page. But it's all about either people gaining weight or losing weight. And it's just, it's just not something I want to see when I'm like trying to be mindless, you know? Because it's, it's kind of a triggering thing for me. It's like, 
like I feel like I've always been on this like weight loss journey like I feel like I'm always trying to like lose weight like and I know I don't like I know I'm, I'm healthy but for some reason I'm always feeling like I'm on this journey of like trying to lose like five more pounds ten more pounds and it's just exhausting and so when I'm finally like you know what I'm healthy I go to the gym I eat well like there's just not much more I can do here and when then I see the, those TikToks about these girls losing all this weight, they looked amazing before. It's like, that's not what I want to see when, when I'm trying to be mindless and have a good time. You know what I'm saying? Does anyone else get on TikTok and just be like, wow, this is toxic. This is not good for my mental health. Because I, I want TikTok to be like Vine. Vine was so... It was such a thing when I was in college, my like sophomore year of college, and I loved Vine. And I like don't understand why it just plummeted so quickly. Look at this highlighter. Do you see that? That's crazy. But I miss Vine, and I just want TikTok to be like Vine. But I don't know. Does anyone else feel this way about TikTok? How it's just toxic and just ugh, too triggering. Like I just don't want to see that. Anyway. Um, I'm about to finish up wrapping and I'm going to do some more work and I think that's pretty much all that I have really today. It's more of a chill day. I went to the gym this morning. I go to the gym uh, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday in the morning and I love it. Sometimes it's hard to get there but you got to be disciplined. I've been consistently working out for like 10 years though, so it's kind of just like built into me at this point to go to the gym. But yeah, look at that. Look at that highlight. I'm gonna finish up wrapping. We finally got all of our gifts done. Um, we had to pick up a few things for our nieces and nephews and um, some gift cards and stuff. So I'm going to finish up wrapping. I have this to wrap. I have that to wrap. And then, um, I have a couple of these bags that I need to put all those things in. So after that, my, uh, my wrapping should be all done and Christmas gifts should be all set. Yay. I'm finally done. This is Andy's side of the family. This is all of their gifts and gift cards and then this is my family i'm so excited that i'm done it really wasn't too bad but yeah mac is a very good companion he helped a lot and if you've noticed mac is always with me we're just we're just the two best friends that anyone could have right that's going to wrap up today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And seriously, thank you so much to those who support my channel. It means so much to me. I will see y'all next time. Bye.